Hello fellow simmers and welcome to this tutorial from Flight Sim Productions. Today we are going to take a look at how to get your PFPX files into Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Now I know that there's been some people that have somehow managed to connect PFPX directly to Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. I myself have not been that lucky. I've kind of had to do this workaround, but it still works. So let's get to it, shall we? First off, we're going to open up our PFPX. And we're just going to do, this is not any by any means a tutorial of PFPX. We're just going to do this quick little thing for our tutorial. And for this instance, we're going to go ahead and we're going to pick KORD Chicago to KLAX. All right, so we're just going to do our quick little flight plan here. We're going to go in with the 787 random payload, find it, and there's our little flight plan right here. Find alternates, compute flight, and we're going to go up here to where it says export. We're going to click on that. And I've tried, like I said, that other people have used the FSX folder and have done it that way. I've not had any luck with that. So this is just really doesn't even need to be in there because it's not going to work for me. And I also want to make sure that I do not have FSX selected down here. Otherwise, I'm going to get an error message. So... Once we get done saving this, we're going to be looking for this file, KORD KLAX02. I'm going to click Save on that. Got us nine routes, and we can just close out of that. And actually, right now, you can close out of PFPX. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go into where we have our flight plan saved normally for prepared 3D, or if you're using FSX, you can definitely use that flight plan folder as well. So it's in documents for me. And mine is down here in the prepared 3D v4 files. And here is the one that we just created. I'm just going to click on that and I'm going to copy that or control C. Either way we'll get it done. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to start Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. All right, so here we are. We're on our home page or our home screen or whatever you want to call it in Flight Microsoft Flight Simulator. We're going to click on the world map here. And we're going to go down to where it says load save down there at the bottom. We're going to click on that and we're going to load the flight plan. Now, as you can see, there's nothing in there right now. But remember, we copied this. So we're just going to right click and paste or control V. And there we go. There's our flight plan. We're going to open that. And as you can see, boom, our flight plan has loaded. And I know what you're thinking. It's like, okay, but I don't want to start on the runway. It's like, that's fine. We can change that right in here. Let's just pick a gate. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go back to load save. Because if we want to do this flight plan again, it'll already be ready for us. So we're going to click save. And you'll notice that instead of it being a .pln file, it's a .flt file. So we can just go ahead and name this the same thing as before. Only this time it's going to be uh, KLAX or KORD to KLAX. And then we're going to make sure we get rid of the .pln and click Save. And now we are on gate M13. And there you go, folks. It's that simple. Now, I have another little bonus to throw in here, and that's the flight conditions. If you notice, sometimes when you start your flight simulator, it's the uh, weather and time are grayed out, so you can't adjust the time or anything. And that's not good. You want to be able to have the custom weather, in my opinion, or I should say the live weather, in my opinion. So what we're going to do is we're going to go up here to where it says multiplayer, and we're going to click on this X that says off group only. And there you go. Now you've got your live weather. You can set your your times up here. You can set your date. And you're ready to go. And that's all there is to it, folks. 
Again, if you like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell. Till next time, this is Flight Sim Productions. Keep your head in the clouds.